your guitar sage here for part two of black dog by led zeppelin here we go let's do this if you haven't watched part one watch it okay it helps to have a 1958 les paul or a reissue in my case because i don't have two hundred fifty thousand dollars. but um so here we go let's jump into this second riff okay so this is the the part that goes <laughs> Okay, so something like that. So I'm going to slow it down for you and we'll talk about the bits and pieces. Um, okay, if you have, again, if you haven't done part one, you need to do part one because it's going to be associated with this. Okay, we're doing a lot of blues here, okay? So this part goes... Okay, this is going to be at the fifth position. We're using a lot of the A blue scale and a little bit of the A minor scale here. So, you're going to slide up to the seventh fret of the E string. And then you're going to do that chromatic walk like we did in lick one. Okay, very similar to what we did in lick one. So, slide up to seven. Five, six, seven on the A string. And then come back to that seventh note again. Seventh fret. You're going to pluck this G, which is the fifth fret of the D string. And again, you're going to bend it just ever so slightly, maybe a quarter of a step. It's just a really cool bluesy thing that blues players do. Okay, slight bends makes it sound real nice. Okay, so. Then do it again. Now, you might get a little bit thrown off by the rhythm of that, but it goes like this. I'll, do it, I'll loop it for you. Okay, well, actually, I can't really loop that very efficiently. Get it? Okay, so the next part. So we basically are repeating that first part of that lick over again. Okay, so now we're back into lick one. Okay, easy enough. You learned lick one, so now we're back into lick one. I don't need to show you that part again. So let me play this slowly again. I'm going to play it in time so that you can feel it. This is really much about the feel. It, trying to explain the feel is like trying to explain a color to you. It just can't be done. So you need to take the licks that I'm showing you, practice them very slowly, and then you'll get it, okay? So here it goes. It's going to go something like this. Two, three, four. <laughs> Sure it is. Okay, I told you, I promised you some amazing blues stuff. Here's the deal. 
One, I'm assuming that you know some basics about guitar. If you don't, if you're brand new to guitar, go to gettingstartedplayingguitar.com. I've got a free super course there for you. I promise you it will be the first, if you went to see a, a guitar teacher, it'll be the first 25 lessons that they teach you or should be teaching you but I'm giving them to you for free. So go there and get that. For those of you who have been playing for a little bit longer or a lot of bit longer and really want to get your blues chops going, go to unstoppableguitarsystem.com. I've got my super course there with over 250 videos. You can get to access to all those 25 videos for $1. That's right. If you have any questions about this or part one or part three, um, or the other 500 some odd videos that I have here on YouTube, hit me up at Twitter and Facebook, Twitter or Facebook, and I would love to help you. My job is, I'm a guitar teacher, and that's my job is to teach the world how to play guitar. I wanna help you. Let me know how I can help you and make your playing better. If you like this video, hit thumbs up, hit subscribe. Please spay and neuter your pussycats and your dogs. I'm Eric Andreas. See ya. <laughs>